Now it's time for Money Matters. Dieting isn't just something you can do with food. It can also apply to your finances. Rob D'Alessio of Strategic Wealth Designers joins us to talk about financial dieting. Rob, you say that uh, most viewers are paying extra fees they don't even realize. So is this part of it? Is this a good way to trim all of that out of your budget? Well, there's oftentimes a bunch of hidden fees in your portfolios, and it's it's best to go ahead and get a second opinion from somewhere just so you know what's going on in your portfolio. Oftentimes people don't realize what they are actually paying and it can act like an anchor on your accounts. When you're sitting across from somebody and they are pointed out these extra fees that they don't even realize, are they really surprised they've been doing this for a long time? Yes. and, and these things tend to compound over time. And so when you tell them sometimes that they're paying way more than they think about in fees, it, it can get very uncomfortable. Well, and sometimes you look at it though, and it doesn't look like much of a fee, but if you do that over time, it, it really can add up. How much of a, a part of your budget can you trim doing this? You know, we've seen fees in excess of three and a half, four percent sometimes, even higher. And if you can trim those back, if you compound that over a 10 year period, you're talking about hundreds of thousands of dollars. That much? Yes, ma'am. So how do you make sure that you're transparent with clients? Well, one, we're an independent firm. And so we don't have any quotas or agendas that we have to answer to. Secondly, as a fiduciary firm, we are legally obligated to make sure what we do is best for the clients, even more so than our firm. Lastly, we basically just show them everything. We are completely mm -hmm. transparent in everything that we do. So our clients know exactly to the penny what they're paying at every time. So when a client comes to meet with you, how should they prepare for that visit? What do they need to bring you and what do they need to think about ahead of that? Well, we provide them with a list, of course, like most people would, of just kind of a checklist of what to bring in. And then the other part is they need to just come in loaded with whatever questions they might have. We'll be glad to answer all of those for them. I would assume this is not a one-time visit to you. Probably need to do this on a on a pretty regular basis. Yeah, absolutely. We ask for our clients to at least meet us at least once a year, but we'd like to see them more often. We do all kinds of other events, volunteer events, and, and fun social things as well, just to really embrace that relationship. All right. I'm sure people are happy when they're saving money. Absolutely. Thank you. Great ideas. We're glad you could join us today. And you can learn more ways to make your money matter on WKYT.com. And if you have something you want us to discuss, send an email to news at WKYT.com. We'll talk about it here.